like to know if you have a special Rue McClanahan memory you'd like to share with us. Oh, uh-huh. yes. Rue Can McClanahan. You? She was the ultimate favorite person I've ever worked with. Mm. You know, you you when you watch your TVs when you're kids and you do this, right? do that. Watched you, her on Maud. Oh, yeah. Maud was first and right? then uh, Golden Girls. Golden Girls forever. Forever. So I heard from Dell that he had gotten her to read the script of the series, and I said, "Fingers crossed." Yeah, and I was really, really concerned that she was going to say, "No, we're not having any of these people in it. Uh, you get me this person, this person, and this person," because you know she knows she yeah. could film that sucker or cast it. <laughs> yeah. So he called me up after he'd gotten her the script, and she'd called him and agreed to do it. And he said one thing she did say. Uh, is that redheaded woman going to play my daughter? And he said, yeah, she is. He said, well, that's a good damn thing because I don't want to do it without her. Oh, wow. It, I'll get, I get, get goosebumps every time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Asked, yeah, asked the right question there, yeah. Dustin. Yeah. She, she was just so dear. Spent a lot honor. of time in her room. She would hold court. We would be drinking, smoking. It was fabulous. Uh-huh. And she didn't drink or smoke. <laughs> but we had an incredible time. She had in, invited me that Christmas, that New Year's, to be in New York with her for New Year's. It was just great. And oh. tried to set me up with some friend of hers. And What a sweetie. Yeah. Yeah, and what a great sport. I mean, she, they, she really got through, went through her paces with the lesbian love oh, affair yeah. and everything else on that show. She yeah. really, good and, for and real. And one thing she said to Dell was, uh, when she called him up after she read the, the script, was that I never thought I would play a woman in love again. Oh, wow. At my age. Aww. How dear is that? Mm-hmm. And so, you know, it's taken the wind out of all of us, really, to have lost her, because he was going to do, like, a Dallas thing to skip over the... Because the series was a prequel to the movie. Okay. And so he was going to skip over that and sort of have her wake up and say, I had the weird string. <laughs> <laughs> I dreamed I died. <laughs> And now, you know, it's, it's like I say, it's, it's really been a, a terrible blow to all of us. 